Well, hello again. This is Jeff, and I'm going to be playing the Narcos Rise of the Cartels DEA mission. And this is going to be another main battle, so sit back and enjoy. It seems Primo has some indiscreet friends. As of zero, he tells us he'll be enjoying some downtown at a local casino tonight. This could be the break we need. It could lead us straight to El Patron. If he talks, but a few of my men would certainly appreciate the opportunity to try. Get this. Primo, El Patron's right-hand man, is enjoying some R&R &R at a downtown casino. But he's a smart cookie, Primo. He knows this is where he's at his most vulnerable. So as well as having a bunch of armed heavies with him, he's made sure he's got plenty of exit strategies in place. We're gonna have to block his escape routes to be in with a chance of pinching this guy. Yeah, you heard that right. We want him arrested. He can do more harm for us if we take him alive. So feel free to use force, but don't shoot to kill. We'll need to position our units effectively so that he and his trigger-happy henchmen are contained. If he escapes, I'll get it in the neck from Noonan. I can do without that in my life right now. Let's keep it tight, and hopefully Primo will be in custody before the ice in his Manhattan is melted. All right, well, let's kick it off. Seize us. Oh, that bomb just... That totally destroyed that dude. Nice. Cargando. A su servicio. Seguro. A la carretera. Oh boy, if Morales takes another shotgun shell, he'll probably die, so let me see if I can get him across here. Oh, 
Oh good, he's not following. I thought he had I thought he had hunt him down, but he didn't. Well that's his mistake, because now I can use the bombardier to probably finish him off if I can get the angle. Yep, right here. Okay, so he's gone. Good. Phew. Yeah, because he chose to go into the house to you know, into this building to shoot him again, he would have died. So I got lucky there. And now what I probably should do is, well, I have to end that turn. Because the, what the uh, enemy will do is they will uh, go after whoever is hurt just to try to wipe them out. So your weakest, your weakest uh, squad member will um, be attacked. This is just a game mechanic that, you know, sweats off a point, you know, by resting. Okay, so, alright, he's back to full. Oh, this is where I gotta go, right here, I guess. Let's see, oh, here he is, right here. And I gotta kill the Sicarios. Okay, well, let me see, can I... How do you guys get down? Oh, over here. Oh, he can't get a shot on him. Well, that's not good. Oh no, mm, that's a mistake. Oh boy, okay. Oh, well, let me get my bombardier down. Affirmativo. Which he's a slowpoke. Enterado. And I have to reload him, so. Affirmativo. Enterado. Afirmativo. su servicio a la carretera seguro a la carretera Por 
Deni. En avanzada. cargando a la carretera seguro en posición Gonna lose them. Okay, so I lost Morales. Oh well, that's the way it goes. I mean, he did a good job, but it's just that uh, he was hurt too much, and he doesn't have a medical pack because he has a grenade. But at least I killed their bombardier, so now. Oh, there's a guy right here. Very good. Okay, and that's the problem with the uh, one turn the thing is because, you know, you get the guy way over there and you just can't uh, get your other team members in. So now I've got to get Carrillo going. Oh, 
the guy right there. Déjeme pensar de esta manera. Lo tengo. Cargando. Me dieron. Nope, I lost the Oh well. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, so you're gonna go right here. And you're gonna kill this guy right now. Got to right. reload. All right, it's just you and him now. Otherwise, and if you die, I fail the mission. I can lose two members, but No valid target. Hold on. All right, I got him. Well, not the best uh, play because I lost two guys, but I can replace them and towards the end of the campaign so you know that's the way I look at it um, you can see I still get an A because I did the objectives and um, 
But I lost two guys, unfortunately. So for Morales and Herreras, you know, RIP for you guys, but thanks for your service. I just got word that El Patron has cut a deal. He's turned himself in to face some bullshit charges, which will see him do minimum jail time. That's bullshit. And the Justice Department is going along with it? And that's not the best part, Agent. He's been held inside of a prison which he designed and built with his family nearby. And no cops within two kilometers. At least if he's in this joke of a prison, he can't be in the thick of things. It might be possible to do some real damage while he's out of the picture. All right, well, that was it. Um, I'm going to call it a end for now, and um, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Adios. Jeff signing off.